Is your WordPress site slowing down due to heavy media files? Do you hesitate every time you upload a large image or video, watching your storage fill up and your load times drag? Maybe you've experienced that frustrating moment when a visitor bounces because your gallery just won't load. Sound familiar? The good news is there's a smarter way to manage your media without investing in expensive hosting upgrades or unreliable cloud storage. In this video, I'll show you how to integrate Cloudflare R2 with WP Media Folder by Joom United. You'll learn how to streamline your media storage, improve site performance, and give your visitors a faster, more seamless experience. Ready to optimize your WordPress media strategy? Let's dive in. Let's start with Cloudflare R2, a powerful object storage solution designed to offload your media files, like images, videos, and PDFs, from your WordPress server to the cloud. Why is this important? If you're managing an e-commerce site or a content-rich blog, you know that each new media file adds weight to your server, slows down your site, and can even increase your hosting costs. Cloudflare R2 solves that by shifting your media to a globally distributed cloud network, reducing server strain and improving page speed. And here's what makes it stand out. R2 doesn't charge egress fees. That means no hidden costs for serving media to your visitors, no matter where they are or how often they access it, unlike many other providers. For businesses, that means you can showcase high resolution content and videos without worrying about performance issues or storage limitations. Creators and bloggers can scale confidently, knowing their hosting plan won't buckle under the pressure. Best of all, WP Media Folder handles the integration with ease, so managing media across your WordPress site becomes fast, efficient, and intuitive. Let's walk through the setup process. It's simple. First, log in to your Cloudflare account and click on R2 under the storage menu. Then, click Create Bucket. Give your bucket a unique name, such as My Media Bucket, and click Create. Next, you'll need to generate API credentials. Click Manage R2 API Tokens, then Create API Token. Name it something recognizable like WP Media Key and grant it the necessary permissions for your bucket. You'll receive an access key ID and a secret access key. Copy and save these securely. Now switch to your WordPress dashboard. In WP Media Folder Settings, go to the Cloud Storage tab and select Cloudflare R2. Paste in your keys and bucket name then save the configuration. Before we move to see your files, let's take a look at the setting. Copy to Amazon S3 to send new uploads straight to your S3 bucket, keeping your server free. Next, turn on attachment label to tag files in your media library, showing they're stored in S3. Finally, enable remove after upload to delete files from your server once they're in S3, saving space. Just toggle, save, and you're good to go. Simple, right? Now that you've got the basics set up for offloading to Cloudflare R2, let's take it up a notch with some advanced options to give you even more control. Scroll down to Advanced Settings and Actions in WP Media Folder. First, import all folders and files from Cloudflare R2 to your media library. Select a bucket and click Import to pull R2 files into WordPress. Next, copy files from one bucket to another. Pick your source and destination buckets. Then hit Copy the files to transfer them. Finally, retrieve all R2 media back to your media library. Just click Retrieve Media to bring everything back locally. More power at your fingertips. Now, if you switch to your media library, you'll see your files will have a tag on top of it says Cloudflare R2, which means these files are on your R2 offload. Now, if you upload a file, could be a product photo or a snappy video to your library. Normally, this would hog space on your server, but with WP Media Folder and Cloudflare R2 in the mix, watch what happens. Upload it, and boom, it's instantly whisked away to your Cloudflare R2 bucket. You can check this yourself. Pop over to your Cloudflare dashboard, find your bucket, and there it is, safe and sound in the cloud. Your WordPress server, still light as a feather, pretty slick, right? But it's not just about storage, it's about using those files effortlessly. Back on WordPress, your media library still shows that file like nothing's changed. It's all synced up behind the scenes. Now that everything's connected, let's see how this works with Elementor. Open a page in Elementor, drag in an image or video widget and add your media. Everything is synced seamlessly. When you hit preview, 
you'll notice the page loads quickly, powered by Cloudflare's global network. Whether you're showcasing products, a portfolio, or a video gallery, this setup ensures smooth performance and scalability. Why bother with Cloudflare R2 and WP Media folder? Simple, it's a win for anyone running a WordPress site. Offloading media to the cloud cuts server strain and hosting costs, while Cloudflare's no egress fee magic lets you serve files globally without extra charges. Your site loads faster thanks to their CDN, keeping visitors hooked and boosting conversions. Plus, it syncs seamlessly with tools like Elementor, so adding media to pages is a breeze, and it scales effortlessly as you grow. Less stress, more speed, and a pro-level site all in one shot. That's it, you're now set with smarter media storage. Like this tip? Hit that like button, subscribe for more, and check out juneunited.com to grab WP Media Folder. See you next time.